it's so awesome to have this community of awesome people that grow into this awesome thing. It's really cold. I'm just out here with no clothes on. Uh. All right, what's up? I'm back. I'm back. I've been on vacation. We went to Disney World. My family goes to Disney World quite a bit. We are Disney World fanatics. And so last Friday, it's today Sunday. Last Friday we left, went to Disney World, just got back this past Friday and recovering from vacation, getting ready back, getting ready to go back to work, all that good stuff. And uh, vacation mostly looked like this. And so we had a lot of fun, and the kids had fun, and I had fun. But I, I wanted to talk about uh, vacation, and it's been a while since I got to go on like a real vacation. Like it's probably been almost a year where, to where it's like completely just no responsibility for seven days out of pocket, you know, pretty much uh, just just chilling and having fun with the family, and I, and <clears throat> it's always. It's always fun that feeling you have when you get back. Hopefully, you know, some of you feel this way, but whenever I do things like that, I, I come back with like this renewed spirit of like, I'm ready to rock and roll. I'm ready to, I'm ready to just crush everything, you know, because uh, on vacation, uh, I get a lot of time to just think about things and just, you know, not be stressed and just be relaxed and having fun. And when you're in that, kind of mode that vacation mode or whatever just that stress-free uh, relaxed environment where you can just chill uh, and think about stuff it, I think that I think that mindset is a lot better for you know positive positive ideas and positive uh, just positive vibes for your life so if you don't take a vacation very often I highly recommend just disconnecting and taking off for a week and go do something fun with yourself or with your significant other or with your family and just have a good time and enjoy it and while you're there uh, think about think about what you want to what you want to do and what you're going to do when you get back and uh, what kind of things you want to get done in the next year next six months next three months that kind of thing uh, i did get to run a couple of times we stayed at the pop century resort in Disney on Disney property and in between pop century if you've never been there there's pop century and then behind that is art of animation and between those two resorts there's a big lake they call um, hourglass lake and there's a nice little running path around that lake it's about a mile and a half so I did that two or three times to where I you know ran ran uh, five, a 5k a couple of times and uh, that was very peaceful. The weather was nice. Uh, it's nice to go from 30 to 40 degree weather. Uh, I know for some of you that's not very cold, but uh, for me, I don't like it. I don't like being cold, but it's nice to go from 40 degree weather in the morning to 72 degree weather in the morning. And for me, that makes it easy for me to get up out of bed and uh, go off on that run. But uh, things I'm gonna, things that I came away with, uh, uh, fitness wise is uh, and goals for the next next few months is just working on hip hip and ankle strength and mobility I think my hips are really tight I watched that uh, it could be just because I watched the uh, David Goggins podcast on Joe Rogan but uh, he was talking about his tight hips and how that was just restricting him from lots of things and I feel like my shoulders hips and ankles are really and not that great a shape. So I'm gonna to try to focus on that uh, a lot more in the coming months and just try to really work on focused mobility and making time to work on that stuff because I don't ever do it. I just come in and work out and then go home or run and go home and don't really spend enough time, you know, working on my hips and my ankles and my shoulders and, you know, getting my range of motion and all those good things where they need to be. So that's something important. Uh, 
among some other things we'll talk about uh, over the next couple of weeks on the vlog. But just wanted to check in with you and tell you that I'm here. I'm back from vacation. And uh, go over to lifteveryrunlong.com and, and sign up for a program. There's lots of cool stuff there. And there's no reason why you shouldn't sign up. So go do that. Go follow us on Instagram at Lift Run Long, uh, Twitter as well. And don't forget about our very cool Facebook group and commu or community. There's uh, a lot of cool people in there and we talk about some cool stuff and, you know, we try to keep the trolls away and uh, keep it all positive. So go over to Facebook, check it out. Uh, that's me. It's Sunday. And I'm, I'm going to get to work here at the gym and get back to it. Talk to you soon.